Holly here again. Welcome back to All the Neffiness. I am back to share with you guys the supplies that I have for the month of September that I ordered from the Emma's Peppery blog. Um, I ordered, as you can see, two completely different sets of things. I got the super bright and colorful, and I've got, since it's September, the beginning of fall, all the nice soft browns and muted colors. So, I'm going to share it all with you guys, as I promised. Um, I'm really liking these videos of sharing the supplies that I have, because that way you guys know the kind of stuff I'm using on my layouts. And it's just fun to share, to be honest. <laughs> I really do enjoy sharing all the awesome goodies that I get from Emma's Peppery. So, let's get started. I say that we start with the things that we kind of know about already, and then we'll go on to the fall stuff. So, let's begin. Alright guys, so first of all, I ordered for the first time some embossing paste. I have never, ever used embossing paste. And I ordered it because I really wanted to give it a try um, and, you know, just to see how I can manage to get creative. Um, I'm kind of enjoying sometimes, you know, getting a little more mixed media in my layouts. So I ordered this little jar of the Dreamweaver Stencils Embossing Paste. And I hope to use it with some of the stencils that I have here at home. And you guys remember my last haul video, I ordered that um, scalloped stencil. So I'm going to try it with that and see how it goes. Um, but yes, I ordered some embossing paste. And then, guys, I ordered a lot of the a collection, the Summer Lights collection by Pink Paisley, as you can see here. So I do have quite a bit of um, supplies from the kit and then also a few papers. So some of the supplies that I got were the Summer Light stickers. And I'm getting excited. I'm bringing everything out. Um, <laughs> but anyways, the Summer Light stickers, it comes with 92 pieces. And this is the 6x12 that has the front and back full of stickers. So here's a look at the whole thing here. I absolutely love the Pops of Pink and this like foiled paper um oh my gosh I can't think of the word for it but it's got like it's like psychedelic <laughs> it is so cute so I know some of you guys already know about this collection it came out I think uh early this summer and I hadn't had the chance to purchase it and in the month of uh I think at the end of July um, they restocked, and I knew I had to get as much of it as possible. So, I love it. It's like completely modern for summer, and I can't wait to get these bright and beautiful colors on my pages. So, I also got the thicker packs, and I love these. Uh, you guys know I'm a huge sticker person. I love, love, love anything chipboard or stickers, so I not only did I get the cardstock stickers, I also got the chipboards and uh, the chipboard thickers. This one's called Summer Lights. Um, this wave, I've been seeing it everywhere. I cannot wait to use it. We've got the beautiful mermaid. Super cute. And here's a little bit more icons in the back. I love it. So cute. So cute. And then I also got these Summer Lights uh, small stickers. I think these might be clear. Yes, so they do say transparent. Um, so I don't have to take them out. <laughs> and again, it's got a whole bunch of icons. I, I'm i noticing that uh, this collection has a lot of like... Oh gosh, I'm like horrible at describing. But like light beam pictures on it. Like it's super awesome. They're glowing. And like I said, this has 37 pieces, they're transparent, and they've got an ombre from yellow to like hot pink. Super cute. So then I also got the Summer Lights Ephemera Pack, and I'm going to open this up and share what's in the back. Here's a quick look at it. But I have not opened this and have not looked through it, so I'm going to do it now and share it with you guys to see what's in there. Alright, so let's take a look. This says light it up. This look, looks like it's a little Polaroid strip, like a photo strip. I wish I knew what the name of this, like, mm, 
foil there is on it. I can't even think of the word, guys. I'm so sorry. All right, we have this little sign that says I'm never going home. Got a tag. Another Polaroid, and then it's got some flip-flops that pop out on the inside, and, you know, you pop it out. Mermaid hair, don't care. The ocean is calling. Got some super cool waves. A little seahorse. This says summer. Fun. The font is so fun and modern. We've also got a peace sign um, hand, and this is like popped out. So cool. We've got little bits here, a little rainbow, some sunglasses, a surfboard, another pair of sunglasses, some super cute emoji faces here, and a little seashell. So we got seashells right here too, a little sand dollar. This little tag, this is good times. Got a popsicle, <clears throat> a larger surfboard, cute. This says sun bleached dreams. <laughs> um, another popsicle. And here's a little Polaroid, which the inside already popped out. But like I said, the insides have, like they're really taking advantage of everything. The inside has a poppable seashell, like so. And that's it. That goes to the inside here. A little starfish. Hey girl, hey! <laughs> we say that all the time, my husband and I, my friends. Beach babes, every moment matters. Another little Polaroid with uh, three layers. So this is a Polaroid, there's another little one there, and the star in the center, they're all pop outs. This is chillin', and again, it pops out. So cool, I like that. And then, fun, 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 with, again, seashells that pop right out. Super fun. And then this just comes out. So, this is the ephemera pack, guys. I really like it. Again, the foiling that it's got is super, super awesome. The pops of pinks and really almost red and orange and yellows and purples and mints like I just love the mix of colors in this so let me now show you what kind of papers I got all right so I did get a couple of sheets of paper um, again from the summer lights collection so let's take a look so first off I did get the summer lights sheet number one with the cut aparts and I like it it's super cool again it's got all the super fun colors and the titles and everything the back is just a super cute sort of watercolored stripe. I don't know if you guys can actually see the stripes, uh, but they're like a little bit muted. They've got a little fading on it. I like that effect. The next paper is paper number two for summer lights. And this to me looks like a sunset. It it really does. Um, this is the water and the sunset and it's like darker in the sky like it's it's a cool paper the back is just a pattern paper um, with like some kind of like squares and circles and lots of lines I don't know how to explain it again very muted it looks like uh, everything has a lot of like layers on it super fun page number three is the super bright and colorful polka dot paper which is adorable I like it and the back is this yellow um, seashell patterned paper. So if you guys can see close up, there's all kinds of little seashells drawn on there. Little starfish. Super cute. So that's the back. Then I've got paper number four. It just has a bunch of words here, which is super cool. I don't know if they're meant to be cut apart, but they're super cool. The back of this paper has sort of like okay so there's stripes and then they're way wider out here and they narrow down at the bottom and then there's like an ombre effect with yellows pinks and then it just fades out super cool it's such a cool collection like I don't really know how to describe it other than super fun and new like completely modern uh, page number five has these clouds 
again they're supposed to be like little beaming lights and then the back of this paper has the four different colors of like pinks that they have so they've got that purple soft pink hot pink and like a peachy reddish pink and that's the back of page five page six is this super awesome background wood green paper like wood palettes all in the hues of like minty greens and then there's white and gray this is a super cute page i love this one the details on this are amazing and the back is just simple um gray circle type of pattern in the back with a little bit of white so that's the stuff that I ordered from the Emma's Prippery blog this month using all of the Summer Lights collection, um, which I am completely in love with, and I cannot wait to start playing with all these super fun, bright colors. So I can't wait to just use all these bright, colorful pieces on my layouts. Um, so yes, let's go on to the whole different collection it's not summer anymore it's fall so let's go take a look all right guys so this month one of the challenges on the emma's preppery blog for the month of september is to um use the pebbles collection so i decided to order the very brand new jen hadfield homemade collection and this one the collection is called heart of home and um, I ordered a lot of pieces from that collection and then I also ordered some thickers that are not from that collection this one I think is called from the oh gosh girls day something about girls is the name of the collection and I just thought it went really well with what I have here so let's take a look into everything that I got here I got some papers I got some stickers washi tape so let's take a look all right so I want to start off by sharing the Jen Hatfield homemade uh, heart of home collection for fall 2017 uh, washi tape so I did order the set of washi tapes and these are super cute so we've got like a leaf vine here with uh, it looks like copper like a copper type of um, gold foil on it then we've got a really soft muted um, stripey skinny washi tape then we've got a floral one there, which is super cute. And then we've got another uh, sort of copper gold foil butterfly washi tape. And these are super adorable. I cannot wait to use them a little bit. So here's a sweet little close-up for you guys. Super cute. And the set comes with four. And they're just perfect. They just go so perfect together. So like I said, I didn't um, get thickers that were for this collection. In fact, I don't think, actually I did, but I wanted some black ones. So I did get the thickers that go to the collection, but I wanted black ones. And this thicker set is called Skylar. And it's, I just love the font. It's so skinny and cursive and it's just adorable. They've got a lot of hashtags. So uh, this one again is something... Uh, I will write it down below here in the video to let you guys know exactly what collection it is because I don't quite remember. But it is from Pebbles. Alright, so I did get the dimensional stickers for the collection. And these are so cute. Uh, I think I will bring these up a little bit closer for you guys to see. We've got this one that says blessings. Uh, this one says love. We've got a heart that says thankful. This frame says thank you. We've got a cute little pinwheel that says hello, and then grateful heart. And there's a total of six pieces in this little set, and they're so cute. These will just perfectly add the perfect detail to any card, any layout. These are always fun to use. I also got the thickers, as I just mentioned. So this one is called Family. And these are, as you guys can see, the thickers have glitter on them, gold glitter, and there's front and back. So let me read out the titles that they have. Heart of Home, Grow Together, Thankful Heart, Stronger Together, Home Sweet Home, Love Grows Here, and Family Gathering. So as you guys can see, these are perfect for fall and 
you know, all those, you know, everything that comes with fall just reminds me of family and coziness. So these are perfect, even including for Thanksgiving kind of layouts. So these are just beautiful and they're glitter. So what else do we want, right? <laughs> perfect. So I also ordered the accent sticker sheet and this comes with 47 pieces and I'm going to bring these out again. These are the six by 12 sheet front and back. And I just love to open this up and take a good look at everything that's included. As you guys can see, this hints to some of the papers that are in the kit. Everything is just floral, very wood grainy, complete, you know, completely fall here. Like this is what I see. I see fall, I see leaves, I see everything that is just warming my heart instead of melting it because I'm kind of over summer. <laughs> This makes me feel like I'm over summer. So as you guys can see, there's like a home. We've got a lot of profiles here, which is super cute because that is like for families, you know, if you want to scrapbook a family photo. We've also got birds here, lots of little trees. We've even got a rain boot. Like how adorable is that? Um, lots of little nests and birds and, and vines and flowers. It's beautiful. I am in love with this collection, and if you guys notice, there's also tons of pops of pink here. So, not only do we have gold, like, we do have gold here, but it's more of a muted gold rather than the glittery stuff we've seen in the other stuff that I've shown you guys. Um, but, you know, there's also greens, and then there's the soft pink, which is the stuff that I love. So, super cute. I love this. And again, there's 47 pieces. Alright, so I did also get the ephemera pack, and I am uber excited to open this up. Here's a closer look at what is included in this ephemera pack. I believe there's 40 pieces. Again, and you guys can see that there's going to be gold, yeah, there's 40 pieces. There's going to be gold foil. There's going to be leaves, lots of leaves for fall, and, you know, tree stuff. So, let's take a look. Let's take a good look at this collection because I am totally loving it. And I haven't looked through much of this stuff, um, especially the ephemera piece. I haven't looked through it, so you guys are catching it at the same time I am. So I'm excited for that. Okay, so this says collect moments, not things. And as you can see, we do have gold foiling, but it's more of that matte gold. It's not that super bright one or not super bright but super shiny butterflies we've got three beautiful butterflies some vines here this is cute it's a card that says bless this nest grow together in love we've got a rose again in the gold gold foiling count your blessings and home sweet home so cute all right, the other half includes lots of florals and leaves. So we've got, again, vines. These are green. These are two different hues of green. We've got, like, some bluish-grayish leaves. This has a, it says Grateful Heart. We've got some more leaves here. And these are all, like, fall-inspired leaves, if you guys can tell. We've got a little floral piece there. Another rain boot, black and white polka dots. How perfect is that? Some cute little, little stems there. A heart that says family. And a soft pink heart. Again, with the face profiles, there's the woman and the boy, the boy one, the child. And one more rose floral. We've got some trees here. Perfect for like family tree this is scrapbooking. Super cool. Another butterfly. That one's like a dark brown. Some random leaves and little vines. This little circle icon that's got the florals in it. Adorable. Big, big rose. Or it's not a rose. It looks like a different kind of flower. <laughs> um, we've got a tag that says hello there. And we've got a pink tag. Home is the nicest word there is. Oh, this is so cute. It looks like a pegboard. Uh, we've got one that says, a little tag that says Grateful Hearts, and it's got date, and it's got place for journaling. 
we've got one that says thanks a bunch we've got a little tag that says thankful and one that says happy birthday and that is what is included in the ephemera pack so I love it the whole um, theme around family and fall is just perfect you guys I cannot wait to get started with this collection so I hope you guys liked this collection I haven't really seen too much around um, of this collection precisely so I hope that you guys like it look at the color scheme okay so I still have to show you guys the papers I almost forgot so <laughs> let's take a look at that okay so I got quite a few of these and I did get doubles for some of these because I really liked the cut aparts and I also like the patterns on the back so let's get started the first sheet I got it was this cut apart and you guys can see it's filled with so many cut apart cards all of them filled with titles top one says together is my favorite place to be choose joy look for blessings everywhere home is not a place it's a feeling grateful heart a house is made of wood and stone but only love can make it a home collect moments not things house plus love equals home we are family this is so cute I've got your back and love grows here so I got I believe I just got one of these and the back is this super cute pattern paper each one of the sheets also has the bottom um, I forget what it's called but the little strip at the bottom you it's got a pattern on it on the back of each sheet so you can always save those or use them in your layouts I love the detail to this paper it's got tons of like little weeds they look like little weeds to me and then it's all printed above like it looks like a newspaper print background so cute all right so I'm just recording this at a different time but let's continue on with the papers I got quite a few papers from the heart of home uh, Jen, Jen Hatfield collection um, because they were very very pretty there was a lot of cut apart sheets and a lot of gorgeous pattern papers so the first sheet that I want to share here is called the love at home um, paper sh uh, 12 by 12 sheet and as you can see there are tons and tons of 2 by 2 little squares here that are beautiful so many so many of them have titles and you know icons and they're truly beautiful with a lot of uh, family themed quotes and the back here has um, some pretty little daisies on like a gray uh, super cute gray and then the bottom st uh, stripping paper has some cute little twigs here that I'm going to show you a cute little close-up of and these are adorable I love this sheet then uh, we have this one is called gatherings and this is just a beautiful floral detailed paper the back has some gorgeous gorgeous pink stripes with baby pink and white and these are absolutely fabulous the bottom stripping has some pretty little green vines super cute then we have this one is called pretty peony and they're just a bunch of peony flowers beautiful on like this brownish grayish color and the back has some like sort of brush stroked stripes um, there's a little detail to the stripes here they're not completely solid and the bottom stripping here super cute then we have another uh, cut apart sheet here I actually got two of these because I wanted to cut one out and then I also like the back of one of them these are actually all tags as you can see here every single one of them has you know space to hole punch so these are actually really super cool this paper is called from me to you and the back are some fabulous pink polka dots so you guys can see there's a lot of pink in this collection definitely a lot of it and I think that's what draws me so much to it um, this one is called climbing ivy and I only got one sheet of these and I really really do regret it because it's beautiful I would love to be able to use the words and the back pattern um, but here's a look at the words they're called climbing ivy so you can see here the flower I'm sorry the letters are kind of drawn out with little ivies and and vines and the back is this beautiful beautiful paper beautiful paper 
I love it. And then the bottom strip has just a bunch of different words here and some beautiful script. The next paper is called Antique Tile and it actually really does look like some antique tile. Beautiful. Can you guys see that pattern? And the back is just like this really pretty pattern with black and gray and the bottom has some wood grain here, wood grain chevrons. And since I am recording this at a different time, I actually did get into just a few of the sheets here. Um, this one was called hair, um, not heirloom, heirloom <laughs> floral. And what I did was um, cut out most of the paper, as you can see here. Um, I cut out all these little floral pieces to use on one of the challenges for the Emma's Peppery uh, for September. And the back. Uh, was just this pretty blue with like little vines and flowers there and the bottom strip is like this little cute like a little stitching detail a uh, navy blue type of detail but yeah this one was super beautiful again the pink and the white was a huge statement for this collection and then one more sheet which I do not have the name of unfortunately let me see. Oh, I have it right here, friends. Hooray! So this one is called Bless This Nest. And as you can see, they're just a bunch of little birdies and little nests here in like a tree. Super cute. And then the back are just these super awesome green vines, which I kind of uh, haven't figured out how to use them, but I really would love to cut them out and create a layout with them super cute. I ended up just uh, using this pattern here for a layout again for September for EP uh, which has a process video so you guys will get to see that and the back of the green sheet has this gorgeous um, stripping paper here with beautiful butterflies. So these are the sheets that I got from the uh, haul and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video for my September supplies for Emma's Peppery. I did order quite a lot of beautiful supplies and I hope that you guys go check it out. I've linked the shop down below so you guys can go check out all these items and grab some super fun stuff yourselves. So thanks so much for stopping guys today and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!